Hello guys, hope you are good. I welcome you all uh, in uh, our first discussion forum. So as you can see that here is uh, our first discussion topic. So uh, for this discussion topic, I want to brief you that actually what are my expectations that what actually I would like to see that in your discussions. And uh, before this, just talk about on the discussion topic, first I would like to tell you that here actually uh, what you need to do, if you see here that uh, we are talking about uh, the two different version of Python, Python 3 and Python 2. two. So if you see this documentation here, so we can just see that actually what type of the different, you know, the version of Python. So you can see here the details of Python versions. Starting from point one one point four until until today and under today the, the version is three point nine one. So if you will click uh, these versions so you can see the different details and this is actually uh, the official site of uh, Python language. And uh, if you want to install uh, Python into your machine, so you can just uh, uh, click this one and you can uh, just download the latest version of Python into your machines. Because without uh, installing Python into your machine, it will be hard for you guys to code into Python. The good thing is that if you don't want to install, uh, and, and actually this is called the IDLE, like uh, Integrated Development Language Environment, that, uh, that how actually you can code your language. Okay, so, uh, the good thing is nowadays, as you as you see that there are uh, many cloud-based environments are available where you can go and code. So now I would just tell you that if you don't want to install uh, Python into your machine, so you can use like uh, uh, Python anywhere. So uh, the way is very simple. So you need to click when you will visit this uh, site. So you need to just click this one. So when you will click this one, so it will ask your username, email, and once you register, so then you can directly uh, write code on the online. There is another online option. And here you can see that I have registered my name here. So this is actually the area where you can code it. And here you can find the result. For example, if I want to write a code, so I will write, for example, hello. This is me. Okay. So when you will, uh, so to execute uh, this code, we need compiler or interpreter. So when you will click this, so this will compile your code and see. Here is the output window, which is exactly showing you. Uh, this is the, this is called the uh, statement. Uh, so print is the command, and this is actually the message which we want to print. And this whole line is called the syntax of Python. Okay, so there is one more option here. So this is also a URL, but you see here that uh, here the version is 2.7 but if you see here the version of the code is uh, like uh, uh, for example so so this is actually the version 3 so now if i go to here and so so you can see that here you can't see any you know uh, the round brackets but here you will see the round bracket and if I remove 
a round bracket from here. So it will display me a line. And this line shows me that there's something wrong with my syntax. If I want to try, if I want to run this, so it will display me a message that there's something wrong with my code. But in this case, if if I just say, for instance, hello, this is me. And if I want to run this, so now I want to execute it. So see, this is me. Okay, but you need to note that here I didn't use round bracket. But if I will use round bracket in this case, and when I will execute this, so then still is it is running. Still it is running. Why? Because it is allowing me both that with arrow or without, sorry, with the round bracket and without round bracket. But here, here it doesn't allow me uh, that I can use the message without bracket. The reason is that uh, in Python 3 or more versions, so you cannot uh, use print statement without the round bracket. But in version 2, until 3, you can use like here it is not showing us any error. Okay, so uh, guys, you can use any of them. And if you installed uh, Python into your uh, PC, so for example, I just show you ideally, ideally is actually integrated development language environment. So for example, I have installed a 3.7 uh, to my machine because my machine is 32 bit. That's why I have chosen at that type of Python. Now, if I just go to the location of my file and if I double click it, so it shows me uh, like, uh, so this is actually showing me the command prompt. So this command line is actually a area where I can write uh, the same statement which I have written on the online uh, environment. So here I'm just writing print, hello, this is me. And as soon as I just click it, so it is showing me that there is a problem with the message because I did close my message. With the, so I just write again, print, hello, this is me. And I'm closing it with quotes, okay? So now when I will run it, so it the interpreter will translate my this code and this is my output, okay? So guys, this is a way that how actually you can run a code on command line. But chances are there that sometimes you need a file. So for Python file, so so then you can what you can do, you can you can create a new file. And here I can write the same statement. So you can just say that print, for example, this is me. And then you just close it and save, save your file and give name, for example, uh, the first ERG program. And if you see, so this is actually the extension of your file, .py. So you just saved it. And now when you will run it, so you can run this file. So here you can see that this is me. So you have find the same result, but in this year, you have given your statement on the command line. 
while here you have actually given uh, uh, your uh, code into a file and the name of file was first prg .pl. so this is actually the way that how you can code your program now i go back to uh, the discussion forum okay so here if you will see so this is the instruction are given that how actually you can download uh, install your uh, the python uh, into your machine or uh, how you can use uh, these are actually uh, you know uh, the online forums or the cloud based environment where you can use or where you can code your stuff okay so now if you see here what you need to do that here see some statements are given and these statements are given on the command line okay so so what you need to do that you need to apply these command line on python 3 and python 2 and then you need to compare their results and discuss discuss that why you actually got those differences or if you got an error so why you got an error and uh, sometimes there could be a syntax error sometimes there could be error because of the version as i given you the example here in this case that when i just removed these small brackets means round brackets so it has given me an error so uh, guys thank you very much i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you if you have any issue or problem so you can uh, write something in your comments box so uh, actually the main objective to uh, to just uh, make this channel that uh, because dropout rate on this course was too much high so i decided that uh, i should guide the students that what actually i am expecting and from the uh, discussion forum and when there will be assignment i will also uh, like have some discussion that what actually my expectation regarding the assignment as well so uh, so this is actually to just uh, uh, improve uh, the clarity or understanding of the students regarding their discussion and the other thing that, that i want to request you guys that uh, just uh, uh, subscribe this uh, channel so that you can uh, see the my videos which i will uh, try to uh, like uh, try to um, create uh, uh, at the start of the discussion forum or the assignment forum here i will discuss also uh, the issues or the problems sometimes i also discuss uh, the difficult topics or if you face any problem, or if students say that you are unable to understand this particular topic, so I can uh, have discussion based on your requirement. Thank you very much.